some time with one of the most amazing four-door sedans. This is the 469 horsepower Mercedes-Benz E55 AMG sedan. the E55 is Mercedes-Benz's familiar 5.4 liter supercharged V8 engine. These are hand-built V8s. AMG is a subsidiary of Mercedes-Benz that specializes in just making essentially locomotive powered cars uh, incredibly fast, incredibly smooth, still all the luxury you'd expect of a proper Mercedes-Benz. But you've got 469 horsepower coming out of this as well as 516 foot-pounds of torque routed to a 5-speed automatic transmission which is in turn routed to the rear wheels. You've got electronic stability and traction control, uh, which will keep you safe, obviously, with that kind of power. But let's take a walk around it, because this is really, really an amazing car. It's always perceived that a one-owner car uh, is a little bit more value in the, or, ha or holds a little bit more value in the prospective buyer's mind, but this car is one of those examples. You're talking an 03 model here with 56,000 miles on it. You've got a couple of really slight stone chips uh, across the lip of the hood, which Pretty much any car that's ever spent uh, a day on the road will get uh, at least some sort of rash, but I don't really have any damage to speak of. The car really is in exceptional condition. You've got 18-inch wheels on here. It's an AMG spec 18-inch uh, wheel, and on here we have an uh, almost brand new set of Kumho Extra RSX tires. Uh, really geared more towards for performance, but uh, a great road tire as well. But look at the reflection down the driver's side. Proper. V8 compressor badge there, indicating that the car is supercharged. But the condition of the paint is incredible. Looking around the rear here, you've got the signature quad exhaust tips across the back, proper E55 badging, proper AMG badging, and as always, the gorgeous Chicago CarsDirect.com plate frame. Check out the reflection down the passenger side though, it's all uniform. Wheels, tires, Panels, paint, everything, just gorgeous condition. The inside follows suit as well. We'll show you. E-Class Mercedes keeps a pretty generous trunk. So this car obviously is no exception. You can see it goes pretty deep, but uh, we have a full set of uh, AMG factory floor mats for the front passenger, driver, and uh, both rear occupants. And you can see under the floorboard here, a little bit extra storage. Take a look inside the E55. Uh, you've got what's called the uh, active comfort seat on here. Uh, you got dual power for one. Uh, you also have a whole uh, control panel down here, which is somewhat of a pneumatic adjustment of all the bolsters, thigh support, and then your lumbar support as well. But uh, easy car to get into. Obviously, it's an E-Class Mercedes, so you've got a really nice, uh, luxurious layout. Take a look at the door. Got a darker wood trim on here, three position memory for both uh, front uh, passengers, and a uh, Harman Kardon badge there for the Harman Kardon sound system. Also keep on the left here a uh, switch for the automatic xenon headlamps as well as a power tilt and telescope steering wheel. Once inside the layout, obviously it being top level Mercedes Benz, you've got a great AMG spec steering wheel with paddle buttons here for the, uh, the shifter mechanism down here. You can shift it as a manual. There is a mode for that. But uh, black script on white face gauges. Pretty unique in their backlit, almost like uh, if anybody remembers the Timex Indiglow. I think that's the best uh, way to describe it. But you've got a multi-function computer up here. Layouts right here on the keypad at the steering wheel. Up above over here you'll find a dual zone climate control for each of the front occupants as well as the individual CD changer, I'm sorry, CD player up here. And the Harman Kardon sound system here is phenomenal. Below that, heated seats. You've got a power folding rear headrest, master lock switch, electronic stability program, that's what ESP stands for, as well as a heated seat for that side. Now down below here, the aromatic suspension has three settings. Right now it's on just the normal comfort setting. You press this once, it illuminates to go to sports one. And if I press it again, it illuminates to go to sports two. Now that, that particular setting will uh, ride right very hard. And, uh, up here you'll also see, once you hit the button to the left of that, vehicle rising. You can actually raise the car up to clear low slung objects. It's a pretty cool system. Inside the back seat of the E-Class is definitely very generous. I'm a six footer, so I'm not huge, but 
definitely still very comfortable here. These seats are set to where I would have them when I was driving, so. One of the unique options on this particular car, if you look here, you've got a, a dual zone rear climate control, which completes a four zone uh, climate package in this car. And if you look above my head here, you've got an Alcantara headliner. Just stop and throw some gas in the E55, but I mean, walking back to this car, this is the first view you get. Incredible. The conditions, unbelievable. <laughs> C55 is pretty quick. And that's instant power, just instant. It's there's very few cars. I mean, the traction even trip there limited us a little bit, but there's very few cars that make power that quickly and uh, you know what a car I mean this has been such a well cared for car it's perfectly quiet I even got the roof cracked open I'll close that up just to give you an idea of how truly silent this car is I'm about 45 miles an hour I'm barely raising my voice but smooth and serene as can be even though it's got all this power this transmission still shifts buttery smooth uh, the layout's fantastic visibility's fantastic everything to the touch is just top end luxury but the beautiful thing about this car is just being able to just jump right on it. Oh, it's like being launched out of a catapult. And these brakes are phenomenal. It comes right down. The alignment's dead on. But get right back on it. Holy cow. That's amazing. We're going to head out onto the highway in the E55. Traction chirp, but wow, it's can slam back and you see with that torque and the power just rolls on. Down hard on the on the brakes here into the curve. Catch up with the traffic in front of us here, but that balance is unbelievable for a car this size. That's also a, a testament to the uh, the handling of these tires. These are a very good compound tire, but as you can see, I mean we were really hustling there and you couldn't feel a thing. Couldn't couldn't hear or feel a thing. You just got a little bit of feedback from the steering, which is very well. Oh, that's incredible. Just too much fun. Coming down the brakes into a sweeping turn and bump steer velocity with nothing there. And coming down nice and hard. Unbelievable car. What a rewarding car. It just breathes so well that that's how much it wants to run. And then, blast off. That is just an incredible amount of thrust in this car. You know, when you really consider what this car is, 469 horsepower. It's got the athletic prowess of most world-class sports cars, an immense amount of torque, all the luxury features you need, plus the solidity and build quality of a Mercedes-Benz. That really sounds like the total package. Uh, the, the fact that this car is in this kind of condition, this well cared for, and still runs like a brand new car, I think demonstrates an even better value. In my hand here, I have a copy of the Auto Check Vehicle History Report. Uh, 2003 Mercedes-Benz E55, uh, one owner, and doesn't really have much more information beyond that. It scores a 95 on the auto check score, uh, if you're familiar with that. Does qualify for auto check buyback protection, but uh, no title issues, um, no mileage discrepancies, the odometer checks out right. Uh, as far as the information that is reported, uh, looks like it was originally a leased vehicle, and shows just shows one owner, and it took delivery, it looks like, in July of 03, so it was a late model 03 as well. You can check out this car on our website. You'll find it at chicagocarsdirect.com where you'll see 60 photos of this particular car. And you can see all of our previous footage. You'll find that on YouTube. YouTube.com slash chicagocarsdirect. Thanks for spending some time with us today. We'll see you next time.